One Owner Car Guy, oneownercarguy.com. And today, I'm actually in Phillipsburg, Montana. Pretty town, it's an old town, but basically, I came here to buy a truck. I got all kinds of trucks for sale. This is a 96 Chevy GMC 1500, 350, it's only got 100,000 miles, four by four. What are you doing? What are you doing? Whoa! <laughs> I got a nice flare side four by four for sale. Even got a nice Dodge stretch cab for sale. All these have about 100,000 miles. This video is about a 1996 Ford F-150. It's a stretch cab. It's just a quick update video. I went to a small town, got this truck today. It'll be getting cleaned up, made to look really nice, and put on eBay. This is just a chance if you like these kind of trucks, and you follow my channel, maybe you can snatch it up before I put it on eBay. That's it, just a quick video. Enjoy, here we go. We're gonna go to work? Yay. Yay, we're going to work? No seat belts, right? Yay. No, oh, yay. Whoa. Whoa, car? Car. Car. Car and a trailer, yep. Okay, I'm back home now, super windy day, and I wanted to just give a quick walk around because I was in a parking spot, and I showed all the, under the hood, I'll show it to you right after this. I took that video while I was there in Phillipsburg, and that, it's pretty much that. It is a clean truck. Um, I'll show you the obvious damages on the other walk around. I just want to make a quick update video, kind of show, because I'll tell you what, a lot of people on my channel like these OBS, old body style Ford trucks, and they're getting rare to find with nice miles. It is right here. It's a 96 F 150, pretty straight, tailgate's been up a bit. Um, that's cracked. And, well, brand new tires. What are these? Wild Peak Falcon, Wild Peak. Wow, those are nice tires. That's coming off really pretty straight besides a couple dings on the top of the bed. And this here, scratch right here. But let me show back up and show you. It's a straight enough truck. Um, hood's a little bit kinked there or something. And that could have had something to do with that fender. But it's not rusty, nothing like that. It's a clean truck. And I love this body style. He's, they ripped off the bottom there. But that's the deal. And you won't hear the paint's not all messed up or nothing. And I was just going to try and make a video of it before I do anything. Maybe somebody's interested, they can give me a call. I'll get it detailed and stuff. But I think it's 150 on it. Seats are incredibly clean. Um, I just bought this here in town just right now. One fifty two eight. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you inside the hood. Headliner's in great shape. Carpets and rugs. Five point eight three fifty one, buddy. Pretty nice. Looks like there's a couple leaks coming up out of here. Is that the return for something? Uh, tranny cooler or something? Not sure, but that's the only really leaky, leaky leak I see on it. Um, and you'll know how it drives by the time I get home, because right now I don't know. So I'll give you a test drive or something. The hood latch is a little wonky. You got to move it around. But that's that. It is a nice truck and clean. It's a got a spray in bed liner and a bed liner bed liner. But that's that. That is a quick update video of this here 96 Ford F-150 stretch cab. So, nice old town. Kind of a resorty type destination now. People come and Fill the streets up on Sunday and buy homemade ice cream and homemade candy and all that kind of stuff and homemade Ford F-150s, I guess. This thing runs down the road really nice. Is that good stuff? Yeah. Wow!